Michigan man finding himself in even bigger trouble this morning. He was recently arrested after attending a Zoom hearing for driving with a suspended license while driving his car. Mr. Hello? Harris, are you driving? Um, actually, I'm pulling into my doctor's office, actually. This is a driving while license suspended? That is correct, Your Honor. Um, and he was just driving. And... He didn't have a license. Oh. So defendant's bond is revoked in this matter. Defendant is turning himself into the Washington County Jail by 6 p.m. today. Ann Arbor uh, District Judge Cedric uh, Simpson stunned by the actions of defendant Corey Harris and revoked his bond. This is today's edition of What Were You Thinking? Oh, <laughs> it's like it didn't even dawn on him. <laughs> right. He's like, oh, uh, yeah. Suspended license. Oh, I shouldn't be driving while yeah. talking to the judge. Too late. Too late. Uh, yeah. Busted. Oh, well. Yeah. All right, guys. So stories and videos like this are a great example of why I am not a fan of full democracy. Okay. Every day I thank God, okay, that our founders were so wise as to make the United States of America a constitutional republic and not a full democracy. Okay. And, um, Again, videos like this, stories like this are exactly what I'm talking about because I don't think that everybody is well equipped upstairs enough to vote. Everybody does not have the mental <laughs> capacity to make decisions about the future of this country or who should lead this country. In fact, a lot of these individuals <laughs> aren't equipped enough to even make decisions about their own personal lives, okay, to avoid being put into jail and that is kind of what is happening here with this man out of michigan uh who got arrested got <laughs> sent to jail basically uh by a district judge uh after he zoomed into a court hearing while driving with a suspended license okay so this guy is going to zoom in to court while driving with a suspended license license okay basically just exposing himself breaking the law and this judge is going to be flabbergasted okay he is going to be in disbelief astonished stunned shocked right that this guy could be so dumb as to call into court while driving with a suspended license so without further ado let's get to it this case people versus Corey harris i'm township Assistant Public Defender Natalie Kate for Mr. Harris, who should be present via Zoom. Mr. Hello. Harris, are you driving? Um, actually, I'm pulling into my doctor's office, actually. So, so I'll just give me one second. I'm parking right now. Wait. <laughs> 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 yeah. You stationary? I'm pulling in right now at the second. Yes, I am. Bruh, the judge tried to help him, bruh. The judge tried to help. The judge said, you stationary? <laughs> right. Nah, bruh, I'm pulling in. I'm, I'm driving. Okay. Wow. Incredible stuff. All right. What are we doing? Uh, Your Honor, we are respectfully requesting an adjournment in this matter um, up possibly two to four weeks if the court would allow. Okay. So maybe I don't understand something. This is a driving while license suspended? That is correct, Your Honor. Um, and he was just driving. <laughs> and he didn't have a license. Oh, uh, <laughs> is with the charges, Your Honor. Yes. No, I'm looking at his yes. record. He doesn't have a license. He's suspended and he's just driving. <laughs> that is correct, Your Honor. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Wow.
this dude's face. <laughs> he has no clue. He has absolutely no clue, bro. Hello? <laughs> One minute, Mr. Harris. Wow. I don't even know why he would do that. <laughs> so defendant's bond is revoked in this matter. Defendant is to turn himself into the Washington County Jail by 6 p.m. today. Failure to turn himself in will result in a bench warrant with no bond. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Your Honor. Mr. Harris, I'll be giving you a call. Okay. Bruh. Court calls the case. People versus Maya Isom. Mm. Bruh. Assistant public defender Natalie Pay for Ms. Ice. Yeah. Again, you know, Democrats, they'll say people like that should vote. <laughs> right. Does anybody really believe that? Does anybody really believe that people like that <laughs> right, should be making decisions about who is going to lead this country. I, I'm so serious. Like, that's an actual real question, okay? And the reason why I'm asking this question is because one of the reasons why I don't care about Democrats and their claims of voter suppression, right, when they come out here and say vote IDs, D laws are racist, okay? And it says that, okay, well, if you have to show ID to vote, okay, uh, then that stops black people from voting. The reason why I'm not phased by this, the reason why I just think that this argument for Democrats is silly is because, well, if you're not smart enough to get an ID, then you probably shouldn't vote, right? Uh, because you need an ID to do basically anything, right? So if you're not smart enough to get an ID or to obtain an ID, then again, I'm not sure <laughs> if, you know, it would make sense for you to be participating in democracy, right? You, you, you would think that an individual like this would, would understand that, hey, let me not incriminate myself while zooming into court, right? But he doesn't understand that. So again, you know, if for whatever reason, okay, he can't vote, Democrats will boohoo on and complain and say, oh, well, this is an attack on democracy and yada, yada, yada. And I'm like, I mean, is that the way democracy is supposed to work? I'm just saying, right? I'm just saying, it is videos like this that, that really do kind of solidify my opinions on democracy because, again, I, I tend to kind of take a Socrates approach to it in the sense that I really believe that it should be the people who are intelligent enough and educated enough to actually handle the responsibility of voting, right, and what it actually really means to elect people and to make decisions for the rest of the country or your state or your local jurisdiction, okay? I'm just saying, I don't want to hear the boo-hoo whining and crying from Democrats when people like him, you know, hey, for whatever reason, they're unable to participate in our democracy. So let me know what you guys think. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Most importantly, share a black assertive perspective. Peace.